class counter. On the class, I have an init double underscore method. We already know how this one works. And then we have a count up and a count down method. Now this is fine. This allows us to count up and count down and keep track of some kind of value. But what happens if I want to do something like add two counters together or view the value of a counter maybe as a string? There's all kinds of operations I might want to perform on this type. And right now I'm not able to do that. So let's see how we can fix this by using double underscore methods. So to do that, we can implement a special method called underscore underscore string. Now this string method is automatically going to be called whenever we try to print out some type of object. And what we can do is return some string that represents this object. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm just gonna put an F string and I'm gonna say return and I'll just say count is equal to and then self dot value. Okay, so now let's go back here. Let's run and notice that we get count equals two and count equals two. So that's great, but we're still gonna get that issue when we try to add the two types together. So what we're gonna do now to implement that behavior is we're gonna define the add method. Now what I can do in the add method is I can take self and I can take what the right side operand is. Then the parameter that we put here, which is typically denoted as other, now watch what happens. Let's bring up our terminal and run our code and you see that we get four. 